Hi guys, <laughs> welcome back to my channel. My name is Patricia Kiharo and this is my YouTube space, Karibuni Sana. I look a little bit different from the last time you saw me a couple of weeks ago and that's because my hair nimefanya blow dry. See what will happen was I've been taking these vitamins for the skin and the nails. Okay, this one broke this morning if you can see and so it looks like a stub but these are my actual nails um, they're not like extensions so I've been taking these vitamins and my hair just sprouted out of my head yeah <laughs> okay obviously <laughs> I'm kidding but see I nimekuwa nikikunywa moringa nimekuwa nikioga nayo nikikura nikimusa kila kitu and imesaidia ndio yangu sana kumea nikafanya blow dry lakini see not a blow dry for high heat just kidogo so that you can still see the curls as you can see quite beautiful huh <laughs> well anyway i'm obviously kidding this is a wig from makeup cloud ke on instagram absolutely beautiful it's synthetic and it comes with a lot of definition when you get it but i brushed it out because i felt like if for it to look natural you know natural hair has some frizz it has some like and I hear it's very natural looking. Although my father would beg to differ, he saw me and he was just like, um, what is that on your head? And then he proceeded to show me that, you know that, that video of the lion that is singing, he showed us that video and he was like yeah this is you you look like a an animal anyway makeup cloud ke um it's a beautiful wig i love it i love it it's so light and it moves like it's my hair like i wish any i wish my hair grew out of my head like this but i don't think i would ever be able to have this much volume or like this camera hair but Okay, that is why there are weeks. <laughs> okay, enough talking. In this video, I'm talking about my experience um, shipping with Savostore.com. Savostore.com is a website that helps people living here in Kenya ship stuff that they shop for online in the States and to bring it here without too much of a hassle of customs or I don't know, it, it, you can't bring illegal things but you don't need to stress about it. You shop and ship and then you'll find it here in Nairobi. You can even get it delivered right to your doorstep if you pay extra for Buddha guy for their rider here. Savo Store did not pay me to do this. This is not sponsored, it's not to do a partnership or they did not approach me to do this for them. I have been saving for a while now and I needed to do a haul and um, I reached out to them and I was just like, yo guys, I would really like to talk about your services. Um, do you guys mind like a deal or something? And so they gave me a discount. <laughs> so I still had to pay to use Savo Store, but this is my honest, honest, honest experience with them. And um, yeah, it's just because a lot of people ask me, oh, how do you ship your stuff here? How do you get your stuff here? And I figured I might as well share that with you. First of all, let me speak about how I came to know about Savo Store. I think I found the flyers at home. At, at my Bona mimi huwa sijimi simu wakati ababo ninafanya hizi kasi. Why? Why do I always forget? Why do I not put it on silent? Anyways, um, it's run by a Kenyan guy called Sidney Karanja who lives in the US. He found that there was a need and he jumped on it. One time, I, a friend of mine was supposed to bring me something. I'd ordered something, it was to be delivered at her house and kachelewa. So she had to come without it. But I spoke to Savosto and they were like, you just have whoever is who, whoever is able to, whoever receives the item, have them send it to our warehouse. They gave me the address and then they shipped it to me. At like It was a small camera, a small one. So it, was, it cost 1500 only. And I was just like, yo, wow. Then I remember uh, DJ Adrian had posted about shipping in parts for his car that he was remodeling. He was restoring an old common gear and he used Sabo Store to ship in the parts and he spoke highly of them. And then Clement Kirago 
formerly boy on the on the boy on the ledge photography also spoke highly of Sydney because he said that he ships in his photographic his photography equipment using Savo store so I was like okay these guys seem pretty legit and they're handling like really valuable items so it must be pretty dope I checked their website a couple of times I recommended it to my uncle he brought in a phone I was like whoa dope a friend of mine needed to get some small musical equipment something and he used them and it also worked so I was like okay these guys are pretty legit so as I was saving up I would every once in a while email them customer care and Sydney himself would respond so I had questions like you know can I bring in a laptop is that something that you guys do if I want um, health supplements you know vitamins and things do you do that and he would respond to all my questions and I was just like okay this is this is seeming this is seeming to be a legit website I'd heard of so many other places as well V2 eh? Mob, Mall for Africa um, box.co.ke there was a bunch of others but somehow I just kept you know yeah it works in two ways you can either shop and ship through them or ship only shop and ship is when maybe you don't have a card or you don't have the means you know a card that allows you to shop online or you just don't want the hassle of shopping from any different websites so they can you can send them the links through their website first you have to create a, an account then you can send them links through their website and a brief description of what it is that you're shopping for then they will buy it for you and have it shipped to their warehouse and then they will ship it to you here in Nairobi if you use that option it will cost a little bit more than than if you bought it on your own by yourself but they will ensure they'll ensure everything like it's full insurance coverage i think for everything that if they buy for you and ship for you i chose to use the shipping only option and these are some of the tips i will share with you when you want to go online shopping unless you're just buying one or two things and you know exactly what it is i would advise you first set your budget and then write a list of everything that you want to buy don't go randomly loosely browsing the internet to see what's there Kwanza Amazon Amazon for me is my favorite website because I can find a lot of stuff all in the same place um, sometimes even like I'll see something advertised on a different website but if I check on Amazon and it's there I, it's easier for me to just shop from there what anyone be Amazon have an app tab at the top it's like explore you can finish all your money there me in fact I'm so glad I don't live in America because those things of same day shipping ni 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 Maisha yangu nikikuwa broke all the time. I'm glad I live here. So I wrote a list. I created an Excel sheet with my budget, the amount that I wanted that I could not spend more than and all the things that I needed to buy. So I was looking to buy a new laptop, I was looking to buy a GoPro, some of these lights over here. Um mostly tech stuff. I don't I, I wasn't even at shopping for clothes or shoes. A little bit of makeup and um mostly tech stuff, stuff on my phone. Um a Kalus Bluetooth speaker, you know, small, small things, a mic, just tech stuff mostly. So I wrote my list and then did my research, found a better pricing. This for me, okay, by the time I shop for things, I've spent months researching on the best thing, right? <laughs> like oh, the best place to buy. Um, I bought some stuff off of Mashable, the website, but that stuff is so useless. It came through and it's just useless waste of money. Waste of money. Waste of money. Mashable, yak. I should have just bought those knickknacks off of Amazon. They have this tool also that I found so helpful. You can put the list of all the things that you have shopped for in one, like in the tool, like with the tracking numbers. And then Savo Store will wait. You you will say what date you want the stuff to ship. See, they ship stuff every Wednesday, so they have the list of dates over there for you to select. And all your stuff, if you make sure it gets there by the Tuesday. They can wait for all your stuff to arrive. As soon as something arrives, they will input there that it's received so you can check to see if they've gotten a certain item. Because, you know, when Amazon delivers something, you'll also get a notification that your item was shipped and it was received. And Savo Store will let you know once they receive an item in this tool. And so you can put everything, everything that you would like to, to be shipped as one consignment. And what Savo Store will do is once they receive everything, they will pack everything again to save you money 
they will put it in a smaller box if things can fit if things can be squeezed vizuri they will put everything so that now you can save money rather than this small thing like now this big box this big box for fenty this one it was for foundation only foundation in a toshia foundation is like a small thing like this in this corner here so what they do everything else that came with this consignment i found they had from what this box they opened this box and put other things so that more things could fit in this box then they wrapped it with a sabo store tape so that you don't have to spend more money on on CG. four boxes of different small small things volumetrically that will become that will come to a bigger volume and that means uh, more kgs so they're very considerate in that way that they they will repack everything so that you can save space and save money and then everything all comes together so for me there were three shipments the first one came in four boxes a bunch of stuff and the reason i had two more boxes was because there was one of the things i bought a makeup um, organizer i liked it so much i ordered another one so it came in the second shipment and um the third one i think was akina fenty the small small two things and 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 mashable one of the things she was taking six weeks to ship so and i think even there's one thing that has never come mashable shame on you i wanted a web a laptop apple they don't accept cards from africa and two they charge tax so like for the laptop i wanted they were going to charge 200 dollars on top as tax he sydney mwenyewe uh, he, you know i was like yo how do i deal with this and he sent me a recommendation for another website something rama i don't remember but when i checked that out i also then found bnh photo and that's the website that i bought my laptop from i found it was even a little bit cheaper but it's the exact laptop that i wanted 2017 and it was tax free and you know once you purchase there's somebody who i spoke to on the phone just to verify that it's me who's bought it and i want it delivered here so it was I felt so confident and I wasn't anxious because now the laptop was the most valuable thing that I and most expensive thing that I was buying. Everything got to Nairobi perfect in perfect condition. Nothing was broken, nothing was damaged. Everything I wanted came like Savo store, they did their part. Everything that um, they were tasked to do was done. In fact, the person who calls you, because see, they ship stuff on Wednesday. Usually, itafika like the next Wednesday or Thursday. You'll get a call maybe Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday. Even the person who calls you, he has a nice voice. He's like, hello. I don't remember his name because every time I speak to him on the phone, I feel flustered because his voice is so nice. Hello. Hi. How are you? How you doing? <laughs> okay. Patricia stop and um, it's very efficient they call you come receive your stuff I can't compare them to any other company because I haven't used any other company but um, you know my experience with them has been great and anyone else who I've spoken to who's used Savo store um, has had a great experience as well I know some people have, have complained they're like oh why did it cost this much and it could be a sort of misunderstanding with how they do the the measuring of the kgs so it's not it's not at the, as simple as this box they come and they put it on a weighing scale and then it says one kilo if something in this box this box is quite big if it was just foundation in here and the foundation is obviously less than a kilo but if you insist on it coming in this box because air freight is measured by space the space that is occupied that's how it's charged so they have to measure the box right so they measure the volume of the box if you remember mother martins it was um length width and height right then that will give you the volume and then now there's um a formula that they use to to convert the volume which is in probably in centimeters cubed into kilograms and yeah they have that formula and you can even find there's a tool on the website that if, if, if whatever you're buying if they give you the measurements of the box that it comes in you can do that on yourself and then input that into the website there's a tool that they have that will convert into kg so that you know how much you're paying for instead of them shipping three of these boxes and charging you more they can just unpack and then repack for you in the smallest space possible and i find that so amazing that they do that because they could choose to just not and make the most of their money but they're also like really trying to help you out so that's what I loved about it. And then, you know, the office, you just go, 
you say I've come for this one, you can pay via M-Pesa, uh, you can pay with PDQ at the office, and yeah, you grab your stuff and then you come and unpack and you just roll around with joy and mirth because you have received your items. It's so wonderful. So yeah, those are the things like those are the things I bought, mostly tech. Um, I'm so excited about my laptop. I got you know the the, the, the sleeve. Um, I got the the adapter thingy because of the ports. It only comes with USB C. So you know I got like a Bluetooth waterproof Bluetooth speaker because I like to listen to podcasts in the shower. The GoPro now I can even swim and shower with it. Come and attack a I can do it. Um, just yeah. I got some gifts, there's some books that I got for a friend who is no longer a friend, but I don't know, I guess I can't give him the books anymore, but hey, that's another story for another day. But yeah, Savo Store were amazing, and if you want to check them out, I'll put the links to, to their website and you can see how it works. It's super simple, super convenient, and I and what I ended up paying in total if I imagine buying the stuff here, like had I bought my laptop here, it would have cost almost double the amount, <laughs> to be honest. And I paid like a fraction of the difference in shipping. And it was completely worth it, completely worth it. They gave me a small discount um, in exchange for doing this video. So that's my, that's my, that's my disclaimer. So they didn't really influence me, but um, I, I wanted to shout about them anyway just because I've used them the boxes are still here <laughs> um, my third shipment was for shoes I felt so I bought a watch and shoes I think that's the thing that came in third and the makeup organizer um, came in last and that's it I'm done shopping for the year well I'm seeing Black Friday deals they sent me an email they were like oh Black Friday is here here is a list of websites that you can check out in case you are looking for Black Friday deals and I was like wow guys do you not want me to prosper I mean I know you want me to prosper but you just want me to spend money wow thanks for your consideration but no I can't spend anymore it's done I'm also not a tea bowling like a gotta save this money yo Anyway, that was my experience with Savo Store. So if you need to shop and ship anything, I would highly recommend Savo Store. Thank you so much, Sydney, Lavina, for your help and the guy with a nice voice who calls me whenever my packages have arrived. Hi, what's good? Hi, it's I'm gonna check you guys later. Subscribe, notifications bell, follow me on all the platforms. I'm working on a lot more stuff for you guys. So, cheers. Thanks. Bye. <laughs>